In a top fighter, do we look for power, skill, swiftness, stamina, and heart? Which of these does Wakataka Kage not show? Alongside, since 2019, the vital quality of being injury free. Think about what he did here. Rattle the new king with tug and right press. Hold the champ for longer than all but Shodai. Then all but beat Shodai. His total domination ruined by this overstep, which even the referee didn't spot. And that was just the January warm up. As from four gut wrenching blows, did he somehow construct a winning score and fine winning run? The rebound began against a man who'd beaten him seven in ten, but not here. Waka's left muscle package of neck, shoulder, thigh and arm uniting to resist, pivot, thrust. His 200th professional win. And the bounce continued against Meisei, sent flying with that parry. Danced to safer ground and round, then engaged head on, no fear, dismissed with low left led advance. Dai Esho greatly troubled by him last year, came armed with the straightest of charges and left Waka's stinging neck nowhere to go but far back. But day eight was more Waka's kind of fight. No thrusts and lots of grapple. The muscle man won a similar bout with spinning throw last September. Here, he considered the same winning grip before going with instinct to deflect and unhook. Tamawashi was absorbed lent round and expulsed on the anniversary of his Komusubi grandpa's death. <laughs> but Kiribayama studied that, especially this move here, so that when Waka went right, he was caught and downed. A game of patience with Uda came next, settled when the technical Magus slipped on the hunt for a leg and invited the right press. Before Tobi Zaru was prodded into place, then rammed head first. <laughs> Wily Endo tried a Kiribayama time after time. <laughs> then 
then faced stupendous knee defense and lift, taking him back to the center. then enabling deception by pulling throw turned frontal drive. A sideways fleeing Chiyomaru was then tracked and hounded from the ring for the magic eighth win. <laughs> but keen to banish the first four from memory, Waka was pumped for the finale against a man going better than he. <laughs> Withstanding flak, then loosening up as Ornoshaw pitched. Five straight wins to close taking him all the way to a new career high of Sekiwake. That first third turned out real bad, but I kept the focus on my signature style, Waka reflected. From then, I imposed myself each and every time, I feel. The collective improvement at Arashio Stable is clear. Recall what he's brought out of his brother and Kotokuzan, and perhaps vice versa. The main thing missing from his recent feats is a win over Ozeki, the rank which he simply must now seek to share with a Toyo Uni senior. He won five Ozeki bouts from last March to July. We well know he can do it. Thank you.